We went. This way? We head for that fire? I don't think we headed for that fire. But I am going to head that way. Oh, they're targeting Tolan. I did not think that good. Feathered spear. Okay. Maybe I was wrong about the Gle Gleo Gle Gleo. What? Are, I'm pretty sure I'm saying it wrong. We were supposed to be able to see the the sealed the shield cracks. <laughs> well, forget that. stick <laughs> son of a
now we found our friend again. You don't know how many times we had to walk past this, right? That's annoying. squeaking.
Okay. What are we talking about? Oh. Shoot that. That was horrible. I thought I'd never see anyone in here. Uh -huh. Oh, I see. Yes, I'm Solomon. Uh -huh. Oh, no. I've made my students worry about me. Guess I've been gone a long time. A terrible blizzard stopped. So I took advantage of the weather to go out and create a new course for my students. Then I found this cave. Just surfed right into it on my shield. Can't blame an old shield surfer to, for exploring, right? Mm. I went in too far, though. Where the cave got all closed off, I couldn't climb back out the way I came in. Worse yet, I heard rocks falling back up at the entrance. Thought it, thought it collapsed at some point. I was starting to think I'd stuck I, I'd be stuck back here forever, and no one would ever be able to find the cave. What? If you're here, that means you can't get, you can't get back out the same way either, right? With any luck, we can find a different path that goes outside. Other than that, though, we've got no hope of escape. Is there a rusty claymore? Seems a little odd. Does this go on for? Ooh, a diamond. More than one diamond? We just did two diamonds? We did. Wait, what does that say? The most precious ore one can find. Its signature sparkle has charmed Hylians for generations. As such, it has sold for a very high price since ancient times. Who 
see where this is on the, on the map. That may have been a lot easier to find. Um, before we go... Back down, though. I want to go back now that we've cracked this tunnel and talk to... Delmi? Some... Delmi? Salami? Salami? And make sure she knows the path clear so she can move on. And we can complete this side quest. I know we haven't done a lot of side quests in the in this uh, playthrough yet. blocking the way they've crumbled i feel wind coming from outside somewhere i'll live another day free to surf the slopes under the bright sky <laughs> i've got nothing to give you now as thanks but i've got an idea whenever you like stop by my lodge in the northwest of hybra peak we'll talk more then you can always spot it from the bonfire out in front so watch for it Watch for that if you decide to come find me. Ah. All right, I better head back to my students can stop worrying. Remember, find me at the lodge on the peak. Ooh. All right. Don't know how to do it. Uh, oh, we're about to have a blood moon. Awesome. Uh, I'm heading back this way because it looks like we may have marked another shrine out this way so I'm gonna try and get that shrine before when the glow of the blood stained moon <laughs> before going back up. I've been waiting for you. Thanks for coming all the way here. Mm. You saved Peach. Oh man, do we ever owe you one? Ah. I'm so stoked that Coach came back to us safe. Major respect for me, man. <sighs> Who knows what would have happened to me if you hadn't come along? I've got to admit, getting some shield surfing in 
all through that cave was pretty darn great. But I'll be staying away from there for a while. That's for sure. Oh. Since I'm the one that really owes you for what you did, I'll be the one to reward you. Here, take this. Well, I've got a shield for you that's kind of unusual. But your shield pouch is full. Make some space for it, huh? So you made some space good now please take this as thanks strong zonite shield <laughs> i found that shield around some stones that get this from the sky what a beautiful thought that there could be shield surfers like us way up there oh. i'll say it again thank you for getting me out of that cave and all and now the blizzard's over come back here anytime you feel like shield surfing with us i wasn't going to take on a third student not with these two keeping me busy but for you i'll make an exception uh -huh. welcome buddy we owe you big time anyway for rescuing teach uh -huh. yeah see you on the slopes best way to learn uh -huh. oh is this one some scheme to get me to critique your form because I'd be happy to do it anyway for you. I'd ask for an instruction fee, but you'll get a reward based on how you do at the lesson. Plus, you get hands-on practice. My fee is 20 rupees. Do you want to get started right away? Sure. Ah! See a, fi a fire for shield surfing burning behind those eyes. Let's not waste any time getting you to the start line. Here we are, the starting line. How do you want to do this? Want a refresher on how it works before you get get surfing? That sounds good. Ah. It's a simple sport. We compete to see how fast you can surf to the finish line. We don't race each other so much as we race against the clock. And just to check, you know how to shield surf already, yeah? There's nothing to it. Make sure you have your shield out. Then jump onto it. Oh. After that, it's cool if you get off the shield sometimes. It's totally legal to accelerate and catch some air. The way you reach the finish line doesn't matter much. As long as you get there, it's pretty flexible sport that way. <laughs> Why don't we start with the, with you showing me where where your skill where your skill levels at, so I can get a read on your technique. I'll put you on, on the beginner's course for now. I know, I know. But you have to crawl before you can surf. It's hard to see this late at night, but Ooh. if you surf down this slope, you'll come to, to a big bridge. Pass underneath it and you'll reach the goal. I posted my other two students along the course. If you head towards them, they'll help steer you in the right path. It's a simple course with a straight path. But don't let that fool you into thinking you'll be, th this'll be a bunny slope. This course is littered with a few obstacles that fell, that fell from the sky, so watch out. Most people would surf around them, but some can find ways to put them to good use. Which category are you? If you can clear the beginning course in under 50 seconds, I'll let you move to step, yeah! step up. Time to get started. On your mark. What? I don't get it. I can't do it. Is 
why is this so complicated? I don't even think it's complicated. I'm just stupid. What is that? That's one of my markers. Oh, falling star. It's a star fragment. Okay. I don't know how to search for it. And I don't know what I'm- it says jump on the shield. was weird i really thought you were capable of better based on what i saw you should have should be able to cut that time by half easy oh. well whatever there's always the next time sure hope i wasn't wrong about your potential though ah. before a session with the coach it's a good idea to scope out the course you're about to surf knowing the ins and outs of the course so you can surf safe is never a bad call ah. to get a feel for the course and a in advance, then you can stay calm and focus when you're on the shield. Oh. Let's call it there for now. Wouldn't want you to run into the ground. How about you warm up a bit before you head out? Sound good? Then let's get back to the cabin. Ah. There's no need to rush. Your journey on the slopes is just getting started. Keep working at it and you'll get there. Next time we do this, I'll be wanting to see how you're, you've improved. 